There's been a lot of excitement about spacesuits lately. But what about that iconic puffy marshmallow suit that we use to walk on the moon? This is what we call an extravehicular mobility unit, or EMU, and these suits truly are in a class of their own. Since Apollo, we've retooled and reimagined what can be accomplished on a spacewalk. And the current spacesuit that NASA uses is based on a design that first flew in 1981. Through rigorous maintenance, safety testing, and upgrades, this suit has allowed us to perform some incredibly monumental achievements and spacewalk our way into the record books. We may have all come on different ships, but we're in the same boat now. A spacesuit is not something you simply wear. It's more like an astronaut's very own personal vehicle. A spacesuit is basically a self-contained environment. It is a mini spacecraft that is tightly wound around a human body. Containing everything they need to survive. Because we are going back to the moon and on to Mars. Exploration spacesuits have to solve the challenges from the past and anticipate those in the future. Some of the biggest environmental challenges that we're seeing is finding a balance between mobility and lunar dust. In other words, exploration is dirty work. Looks like you guys have been playing in a coal bin. I don't know how we're gonna get it all. Let's do the best we can, yeah. Like, how are we gonna clean these guys off before they're allowed to go back inside? There's many ways, and do we know if they work? We have to find out. And when your life depends on a good seal and perfectly performing fabrics, dust is kind of a big deal. Lunar regolith, it looks like it's, it's just a, a fine-grained material when you, when you see the pictures of the Apollo boots in it and stuff. But uh, you're gonna see anywhere from broken rock shapes to fractured glass shapes. That's what it looks like under the microscope, of a, such a small particle size range that it gets in everything. The Apollo missions only needed their suits to last for a few moonwalks. But these missions to the moon and Mars could be weeks, months, and even years long, demanding the most innovative solutions from NASA and our industry partners. Whether we put a protective layer, whether we are able to charge the suit to repel dust, there are multiple things that we're looking at, so we still have a lot of challenges and work. The original EMUs were designed for the astronauts of that era. Since then, our astronaut classes have become far more diverse, and the next generation of spacesuits can follow, well, suit. As NASA works together with industry partners on exploration spacesuits, follow along and be part of our journey to the moon and beyond.